Hello YouTubers and Disney Cars fans, today I'll be showing you the Stunt Racers Transforming Transporter uh, George. Now, of course, this series has been around for about a year now, and I know that um, released before in the Transporters line was Mac, Sal, a.k.a. Francesca's hauler, and of course Andre, which was Raul's um, hauler, and of course they all give them names which are relevant to um, either Italian or or French, and of course, since Max Chanel is German, they give him a nice German name of Georges, at least. I'm pretty sure that's how it's pronounced, but I could be wrong. So I, I was happy to find this today, and so what I did, I actually just stopped into a uh, Kmart, which I do not go to many Kmarts, um, because they do not have that much good stuff in my area. But today, I was actually happy I found Georges, and the main reason I stopped in there was to find some Hot Wheels from the event. Um, on Saturday, and the only things I picked up was um, this 2014 release, which um, is the only 2014 release they had there, which is the 72 Ford Ranchero, and I picked up this new model, looked pretty cool, the Speed Dozer, looks pretty cool. And so let's just get on with uh, Georges, and of course it's from the Stunt Racers line, which has those like stunt cars, which I don't think work that well, but I mean... Uh, it's up to you guys how they perform, but I do not have one, but from what I see, I don't think they work that well. Of course, there's his nice face. Looks pretty cool. And now, one thing that's probably not going to show up on the camera is that too well is that this whole part right here, the cab, and the whole back part is all that dark purple. And the only part that's, like, black is this kind of, like, hat here, which makes him look very cool. I know that the other ones, like, Sal had a white hat or a kind of top, and um, Raul's had a um, red one, but I'll show you guys um, that when I open these up. So let's check out the back here, and of course it shows a nice image of Max Chanel the stunt racer there, and him performing a nice little um, stunt there on the um, thing. Now the only reason I picked these um, haulers up is because I love that it's like a new character, and they look very good with the racers and stuff like that. And, um, so yeah, if you want to check out my other videos, I did a video of Sal and Raul, and, um, so that's pretty cool. And Sal, I did actually show a little bit of the, um, actually kind of showing how it works with the die casts, because it does have that launcher, and see, it does say, launcher also works with die cast vehicles. And as you can see, it has Stunt Racers, McQueen, Francesco, Max Schnell, Chick Hicks, and Mac, and some other ones as well. And now I know that these are really easy to open, as it says easy open, because you just pop this thing right in, and um, it comes off real easy, you just have to turn a few things. But I'll be um, opening this up in a second, so let's just take another look at it in the package. Of course, George looks very cool. I uh, I think George is probably going to be my favorite, so I'll be right back with um, George open. Okay, I got George opened up, and now as you can see, you're like close up with him right now, and that's because I have him on the turntable, and I thought, let's just get the turntable section done with, and as you can see, um, he's Max Schnell's crew chief, and as you can see, you might be able to um, tell that when he comes back around, that the uh, black kind of top on him is actually black, and it's different than the uh, purple. Now, I'm sorry the screeching is back, I have no idea what is causing this and it's really starting to annoy me, so I'll try to do whatever I can to fix it. As you can see, he's got the uh, colors of the German flag there. He looks very cool. So once he's done, and I'll be um, on to kind of showing him in a little bit more detail. So we're done with that for now. And so as you can see, let's move this back over here. Let's move the camera over here a little bit. So as you can see, um, George, as all the Sun Racers are, they have the nice wheel in the front and a fake wheel and then a real wheel, which is kind of disappointing that this is fake, but I mean, what are you going to do about it? And as you can see, he's got all the um, German stuff that Max Schnell did um, have on him, so let's focus in on some of that. As you can see, there's that um, kind of sponsor that Max Schnell has. And, of course, Max Schnell was number four, as you can see, number four right there, as well on um, below my thumb there. There's four again, powered by All in All, which um, I'm trying to look for the logo on Max here. It doesn't look like he, oh, it's, like, very small. 
but it's right above the World Grand Prix. You're not be, you're gonna be not gonna be able to see that. But there, of course, is the World Grand Prix logo down there, German flag, and very miniature there. Of course, huge W. Um, TCL logo and of course nice little logo in the back and same on the other side and I like the expression on George it looks very nice and of course he has the more logos on the front and all that stuff so I like the I, he looks pretty cool and now here is um, the first um, Road Grand Prix one release which was Sal looks pretty cool he's got a nice little expression and let's move on to Raul Saru which is Andre's which is Andre there's Andre, and um, now let's get to the inside. Um, and so, by the way, here's the little instruction kit that comes with them. And there are the four um, that have are released so far: Max, Sal, Andre, and George. I hope they come out with more of them, but I'm not sure. I've heard that there's these ripstick racers that are coming out, and they'll be doing a um, hauler line. Now I'm not sure. I did know that Sal will be coming out, but I'm not sure if any um, the others will be coming out, like George or Andre. And I'm not sure again if they'll have new ones like maybe um Nigel Gearsley's. But let's get to the inside of George. So as you can see his flap flips down. Now I think I kind of played with this a little bit before um I put it on the camera. I think George is the nicest in my opinion be as well. I mean it should it would just be mine, but um his is like the cleanest and um mate is like really nice because my Andre is very hard to get like the top off and the um, the flap down there, so um, I'm glad that George is nice and really nice, and it doesn't I don't hear any cracking noises. So of course here's the inside of it, and where Max Schnell do his nice little stunts. And I did not pick up any stunt racers, and I probably won't because they are six bucks, and I don't need them. As you can see, here's the launcher here. You um, sit all the way to the back till the click is, and then you flip the um, uh, switch. And the launcher launches out. So now, trying to find a way, maybe if I push back my camera a little bit right now. And then we can focus in. Focus in, I said. And um, then we could maybe put him in the back here. And we could get a little bit of a kind of a, um, a launch going on. I just want to show you how the launch works with the diecast vehicle. I did so show a little bit of playtime in the um, Sal video, but I don't think I did in Andre. So it's about time to show some with um, George. So I'm going to try to catch it. My hand's over here. So let's see what he does. Nice um, kind of uh, shoot out there. And now I have quite a few matched now, so I'm not too worried about how it's going to go through. So let's do two for... Um, this way, and then we'll do, um, yep, one on now on this side. Let's, um, probably go this way so you guys can see it a little bit better. Flip the, um, thing up here, and as I, um, you probably not have known, but this thing, yeah, flips up. Now, this is gonna be a really bad launch. This is gonna bad, be bad, but let's just do it. Oh, I'm sorry, Max. Um, I don't know if this is gonna go well. Oh, upside down. Once more. Set them in there. Oh, that's not man. See, yeah, since his um plastic base metal body, he's, he's um top heavy. Yep. See, he just flips right on over. So thank you guys for watching, and I hope you enjoyed this video. And um, yeah, if you saw my last video, it was about the planes four pack. And now let's see if I could get this. Boom! You see here that crack? Not good. So that's why I don't really play with these that much, but. They're still nice, has a nice little display. And, um, so yeah, my last video was on the, um, the Planes 4 pack there. And my videos are coming to a halt because of school starting and everything. But I still will make sure I keep doing, um, a lot of videos as, um, even school continues. And now, K-Day has been announced. It, um, is starting on, or not starting, but it's gonna be... October was it nineteenth? I think I'm not sure, but I'm pretty sure that it is. And I might go, but more than likely I'm just gonna buy a case and do a case unboxing um on live. So that should be pretty fun. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. And if you want Gore, I definitely recommend. He's very nice. Um, I picked mine up at Kmart, and um, usually I buy mine at Target, but. 
Kmart was the first one to have it. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys next time.